what's up everyone it is time for another food review we found something cool at the store i think it was walmart but i can't remember because we go to several different stores when we're doing our grocery shopping my wife actually spotted it and here we go check this out surfer boy pizza all right yeah i keep wanting to say superior boy for some reason yeah superior boy pizza what would that be i don't know but look at this so this is from Netflix is Stranger Things. I've never watched Stranger Things. I've heard a lot of good things about it. I know it's very popular. I've heard it's a really good show, but I have never watched it. So yeah, you can see uh, it's from that show. I don't know if they eat this on that show, if Surfer Boy Pizza is a place on the show, or if they just sponsored them. I don't really know what is going on here. Um, you gotta see it to believe it, my dudes. I don't know if that has anything to do with the show either, because I've, like I've said, I've never seen it. But look, we've got glasses on the back that you can cut out. Cardboard glasses, yeah. So really cool. Cool looking brand. We've got a surfer dude up here. Looks like he'd be a friend of the Ninja Turtles, maybe. But look at this pizza. Yeah, I left it in the oven a little too long. Uh, it's jalapeno and pineapple, yeah. So I made Doc at a point already because if you can see, well, you can't really tell now that, that it's been cooked, but the crust was kind of bent up and the toppings were not evenly distributed across the pizza. I tried to do that as best I could, but you know, with frozen pizza, uh, yeah, it's kind of hard to get that stuff to move. Um, so thumbnail, you can see the jalapenos and the pineapples on there. I don't really like cooked pineapples unless it's on pizza. But yeah, I do like cooked pineapple when it's on pizza. And I love jalapenos, any way you take them. So it's got a thicker crust, but it's not that thick. Like it's not like DiGiorno thick. So it's kind of a medium crust. It smells really good. I'm hoping for a good taste. So here we go. Hmm. It's got a nice little crunch. If I ate um, a jalapeno there, it wasn't hot. Here. Like I said, this was not distributed very well. So let's get a pineapple. Let's just take a bite of this other slice here. That has pineapple on it. Here we go. The jalapeno has no spice at all. There's no spice to it. Look, you can see that right there. That's a jalapeno. There is no kick to that at all. Jalapenos are supposed to be spicy. No, it's not. It, you can't even tell. Let's try another one. Maybe that was a bad pepper. Nothing. The pineapple tastes good. This jalapeno does not have any spice. The pizza has a nice texture, good consistency, but it needs more flavor. The jalapenos need more spice. The pineapple tastes really good. <clears throat> it's got a nice crust. but I need a lot more flavor. It just doesn't have the punch to it. And the jalapenos don't have the kick to it. No punch and kick at all here, so. And the way it was packaged, I didn't really like that too much. Um, yeah. Uh, it's good, I'll eat the whole thing. I mean, it's not a bad pizza. I've never had a bad pizza. Um, it's got good cheese on it got good sauce just I need more flavor and I need more kick um, so I'm gonna have to give it a three out of five I hate to do it I'm gonna eat this whole thing tonight share it with Troy 
Um, but yeah, I just, I need a little bit more punch and kick. So yeah, it's a cool idea. I love the brand name and the look. And I like like the old fashioned look of a box here, like an old pizza place. And I love that it's from Stranger Things because I like crossovers and sponsors and different things like that and uh, advertising. But yeah, three out of five, still gonna enjoy it. But as always, if there's anything you'd like from me to review, leave in that comment section below, like, subscribe. You may like this, I don't know.